Dude Talking with GameStorm. Today I'm doing a video response to the Top 3 Tuesday. Features Christy O'Connell 311, and it's video game levels from hell. The first thing I want to say about this is I usually am able to beat every game that I play. I don't want to be a douchebag. I don't want to sound like a douche. This does sound very douchey, I know. But it seems like every game I play, I, I'm able to beat. But And I don't really get frustrated a whole lot. So uh, this is actually kind of hard for me to pick one of these, but um, I think I've got my three, so here they are. The first one's from a recent game that I played, FCO GX, during my summer games. And uh, one of the levels is Chapter 6. It's called uh, Black Shadow's Trap. Now, this one's kind of gay. <laughs> it, uh, Black Shadow puts a bomb on Captain Falcon's car, and if you go under a certain speed, it'll blow up. If you hit a wall, which makes your speed go down, you'll blow up. And the track is forever long. So you just feel like, oh my god, when is this going to end? You're just sitting there driving for like five minutes and you're just like, can't hit anything. There are so many obstacles. You just get really frustrated. So, yeah. And F-Zero GX, Chapter 6, Black Shadow's Trap. That is not fun. Not fun at all. Alright, so that, that was my number three. My number two is not really a level. Um, I thought about it, and I used to play a lot of Guitar Hero back in the day, and one of my friends and I used to play uh, Guitar Hero 2 over at each other's houses and all that. I had just started getting used to Expert, and then I finally beat Guitar Hero 2 on Expert, but barely, you know. And then uh, I went on to GH3, and uh, on GH3, there was two different things that I thought of in this game that just frustrated the crap out of me. And that was the battle with the devil, Lou, at the end. And then through the fire and flames, of course. I was able to beat the devil, but for the longest time, I could not beat through the fire and flames until I got better. The day that I beat that was like a glorious day in my gaming career. Now I can beat it, you know, willy-nilly. It's stupid, you know, I, I play so much rock band guitar hero. But back then... None of my friends had beat it. I was the very first one to beat it. So I felt like a god, you know? <laughs> like, no one else could beat this. So, that that has to be my number two. It's just Through the Fire and Flames by Dragon Force on GH3. My number one is probably going to be on a lot of other people's videos, I would imagine. But this this level is actually a temple, and it's in Zelda. <laughs> and I think you know what I'm about to say. But God, I remember when I was like 9 or 10 trying to play this for the first time. Oh my God. Like, I, I couldn't even get, like, anywhere. I would get nowhere in this temple and already be lost. It sucked so bad, but... Yep, Ocarina of Time's Water Temple can suck balls, let me tell you. Oh my God. That, I, that's all I have to say. You You already know. So, that's my number one. Alright guys, this has been my video response to the Top 3 Tuesday. Video game levels from hell. Hope you've enjoyed it. See you next time guys.